Hello everybody, I made a Keyboard Shortcut Shortcuts mod for uh, Victoria 3, which I hope you will enjoy. In vanilla, the shortcuts cannot be modified in-game, which is a, uh, an oversight of epic proportions, but oh well, I've done it for you. So, uh, these are just my preferences, but if you download the mod, you should see that it's extremely easy to change them yourself in the code. Uh, so if you want to tweak it for yourself, you will be able to do that. In vanilla, you have to use things like F12 and stuff, which is nonsense. So what I've done is I've gone... Q, W, E, R, T, so that's along the top row of your QWERTY keyboard to get the first section here. Then I've done, because I think those are the most used ones in this menu, then I've done lenses, so that's A, S, D, F, G. F is normally used for the location finder, and it isn't perfect to lose that, so I've made Shift F, the location finder. And then going back over here, we're up to F1, F2, F3, F4, F5. And then outlining, you know, you can use that, but it's Shift F1. The idea is you can hit all of these shortcuts with your left hand. I haven't used ZXCV, um, which I might have used for these ones, because I want to make it such that C is accept pop-ups, X is uh, Z is decline, and X is go to location. But right now, I don't know how to do that. I'm working on that. But yeah, this is mod is slightly annoying to install. Unfortunately, you will need to uh, import the file manually. You can't just subscribe to it on Steam. Uh, there is, however, the mod up on Steam, and you can use the uh, the Steam uh, Steam version of the mod has all the instructions as to how you can enable it. If you want to tweak it yourself, there's a file in the mod called shortcuts.shortcuts. .shortcuts. You can just open that mod and then change the numbers. It's extremely simple. There'll be a list of all the shortcuts. Um, the only one I haven't mentioned is on a tab like... Uh, budget, for example. If you hit W to open budget, it automatically opens the first tab. If you hit it again, it goes to the second tab. Again, it goes to the third tab. Again, it closes, right? But if you use this mod, you can hit W3 and go to the third tab. And then you can go back with one, two, three on those. Note that that overrides the ability to use the numbers to set the speeds on the clock. That's because I use numpad plus and minus to do, the, uh, do those speeds up there, which I personally just prefer. Uh, so if you want to have a go, the link to the Steam Workshop page is in the description of this video. Hope you enjoy the mod. Let me know if there are any other things you think would could work better or would like tweaking, and enjoy. 